All right, well, good morning, everybody. Welcome to the stream. My name is Ricari, and this is Eric, and today is day five of our Horizon Zero Dawn. Quest for the Cup. Quest for the <laughs> Cup campaign, campaign playthrough. To put this in perspective, Eric and I said to ourselves, hey, um, what is it? Forbidden West is coming out February right. 18th. Right. We have not played the first one to completion. I think we had both dropped in and dropped right back out. Right. So in order to fully appreciate what this new title brings and offers, we need to go through the first. Yeah. I think we both agree that we probably wouldn't have done this at home on our own. Not that we don't love said campaign. That's cool. Just that being around a friend and uh, experiencing something together right. makes it all the easier. Yeah, way, way more fun this way. And uh, also time is always an issue. So if we can make this part of our jobs, we might as well. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but we also figured there's other people out there in the same situation. So if you're working and you can have the stream on in the background and also get caught up before the new one comes out or refresh yourself if you already played it, we figured this is good for everyone. So, so with that, here is the game. And I think we are ready to roll. Eric, do you want to give us a refresher on what happened? Oh my gosh. Last time on Horizon Zero Dawn. Yeah, previously. Yeah. Uh, so last time, I jokingly at the beginning of the last episode, episode, the last, when we yep, streamed yesterday, yep, yep. I jokingly said, we're gonna find out all the answers. We're gonna find out where the machines came from and who made them and what caused the apocalypse. And we did find out quite a bit of that stuff. Uh, we found out that almost a thousand years ago. 974. 974 years ago, uh, the machines that were built by this corporation, I think called Faro Corporation, uh, were built for peacekeeping purposes, mm -hmm. but uh, there was a glitch in the system and the machines went out of control. So basically what happened was they were like, look, this is out of control, but the the hologram that we've been seeing, the Aloy is like, is this my mother? Who is this person? Uh, she had some sort of an idea or something called Zero Dawn mm -hmm. that they were going to build or enact. <coughs> Would, they, didn't, they didn't clarify. They didn't say it's going to save humanity or save the planet, but they Probably, said- Probably uh, save the corporation's wallet. Uh, okay. uh, it sounded like the opposite, like it was gonna take the corporation's money to do this. To later get money though. Right, uh, but we are now somewhat on the quest to get answers because Aloy's gonna clearly that's not my mother because that was almost a thousand years ago. You never know. Well, we don't we don't know the lifespan of people in this world. That's true. We don't. She might still be alive. So. I still believe that Aloy is a clone of this world. Oh, saw me. Maybe Zero Dawn is exactly that. It is. It just wipes everybody's memory. Maybe maybe it's providing for the rebirth of the world after the machines destroy it. It's going to clone and restart and kick everything off, plants and humans, and everybody here is a clone of somebody that lived a thousand years ago. Who knows? This is all purely speculation. No, I'm like going up this hill, but I swear this thing just keeps turning. The steps this way keep getting longer? Yes. I explained this in uh, one of our first days of playing. Yeah. Um, I am Mr. Golden Path, right? You just tell me yeah. where I need to go, how to finish the level, and I am okay. Assassin's Creed Origins. Yeah. I 100%ed. I have no idea why. I am usually just not that person. And for some odd reason, the 50, 60 hours that that game has in it threw me in. Okay, so I need to... I think the only games... Oh, I... there's those things. Oh, and there's those guys. I, uh... I mentioned this on one of the other ones. Infamous Second Son, I got a hundred percent. And then whenever the new Shantae games come out, I play them until I get a hundred percent. Beyond. Yeah. Sometimes I keep playing. Apply those games just for so long. Everything else, for the most part, generally pretty content to play games. I think it's I don't know. I like the linear, linear path games personally. Yeah, no, yeah, that's me. I, I generally don't pay attention. I shouldn't say I don't pay attention. I'm easily drawn away by other things. Oh yeah, I, I my, my ADD will take me in a million different directions, and I just immediately get overwhelmed by a game that's got too much to do, and uh, I'll generally just stop playing. 
I need I need to have that easily focusable path. And you know what's the toughest part too? Do you ever come back to a game and you're like, how do I play this? I'd have to I do not remember. I do not recall. I gotta start it all over then. What that mean? I There's tried. Oh, yep. There's some yellow. That usually means it's a great way to climb back. Seems a terrible idea. In the real world, I would never do this. Dumpster diving? What do they call it? Cave? Cave diving? Cave? Spelunking? Spelunking, yeah. The only, the only thing I know of anybody actually dumpster diving, we were in school. Uh, near our high school, there was a hostess store that just had like all hostess baked goods, and my friends were like, "Well, on these days they throw out all the stuff that didn't sell, so they would go pull stuff out of the dumpsters." Oh, up, down, left, right, up. Well, hey. oh, not that one, not that one. I doubt this is going to be the last one. Oh, I can take that fall. That's okay. Okay, there it is. So that's. Up, up, down, down. Correct? Up, up, up. Up, down, down. Left, right. Left, right. BA. Start. This is a one player game. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's two. I can't tell. This is just. That's the code nexus. Faro. But there's nothing. Isn't Faro like a grain? That's. I don't know. I think it Probably is. Probably right. So I did two of these. Into. I don't see anything here that tells me where it's supposed to be turned. You see what I'm talking about? Yeah. The other one does tell you this. Wait, 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 wait. Do that again. Nothing changes. Everything's kind of blinking in and out. Yeah, it's hard to tell. Matter... There was a verbal hint. Error detected. Consult GT Tech. Oh. Was it this thing? Hey. Y'all wanted to know how I remember the geotherm system reboot? Goes like this. Bird flies north in summer, north. east in spring, right. west in fall, and south in okay. winter. Didn't right. expect to hear nature call free from yeah. lips of Mike the GT tech, now did you? As usual, I defy expectations. Tell you how to do Thank it. you for that. All Thank right, you. all right, all right. Thank you for that. There was a verbal hint. Yeah. That guy said. Oh, that did no damage. Yeah. Ooh, Ooh. 94, okay. Did, what was that roll? Oh, come on, Somersault. There's no way that thing can run up the stairs. Yeah, he's, he's toast though. Oh, it can come up the stairs. I was totally wrong. Knock him over. Oh. Crit hit him too. Whoa, what's up, machine guns? That guy has a gun. Look at that gun. There we go. We knock him over. Come on, can we knock him over? There we go. We got him dead. There you go. Wow, that's a. Say hello to my little friend. The Deathbringer gun. You know what's weird? Okay. I, okay. I had no idea there were guns and modern weapons in this game at all. There are evolved reproducing robo beings. Right, they can't, we did, we got that answer. They can reproduce, yes. That guy did not make it. There we go. We're just gonna keep this thing with me. Yeah. As you do. Can't do it with that. Not with that defeatist attitude. Not with that Deathbringer. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can't bring the Deathbringer. More like the death lever. That's good. No, that was good. That was good. Unaccept. During eclipses, the shadow cast on the moon is curved. Be right. We're on Earth. So the world is a globe. She just discovered this. It looks like this, from a distance. We'll discuss this another time. She's never. Wait. Back to the matter at hand. She probably thought it was flat. Look, no curve. She got up on her highest mountain and said, "No curve." Elizabeth stopped them before it was too late. Oh. But how? Okay. We might be in the southwest. We're on, I thought we were on like a settlement. No, we're definitely on Earth. This is Earth. But in the future, I want to fight that. 
Ooh. It's the Kraken. Where's Mr. Incredible when you need him? The Eclipse. <laughs> Metal Devil. But they don't think they can wake it, do they? Watch out! Oh. oh okay, it's one of those. But uh, uh that's, a, that's a Deathbringer. Yeah, Deathbringer. Wait, that big one gives birth to the little ones? So the one that we got earlier. We took down very easily. Very easy. No problem. I highly doubt. Go over here. You know what you should have? What's that? You should have kept that death ring. <laughs> oh, I can't stand you. Can't stand you. Boop. Boop to Snoop. Okay, that was quite an experience. You guys run around with that stuff on their back. Don't they know what's going to happen? Yeah, don't they know I've got... Fire arrows. There's plenty of stuff for you to hide behind at least down here. Yeah. I assume. Oh no, and that that guy can't blow them up. That death cannot destroy up. So that's good. There's enough people chasing you though that's making me escape. That's why we're gonna get rid of them first. Why is that guy still? Oh, he's about to go. Yep. Pop. Pop. Goes the weasel, goes the weasel, goes pop. Oh! Third base? <laughs> That's a deep cut. <laughs> he can destroy your cover. Got their medicinal gray omen? No, I can't see. Oh, damn it. Yeah, it was still, it was still solid. To blow up that missile or anything. That thing is the worst. It's uh, still not destroyed. That's crazy. That's okay. That's okay. See, those fires look like a place where you can say, but uh, I don't think they are. Alright, there we go. We're gonna pick this up. This up. What did she say? They make a horrible sound in the air. They're scary. Two, three. Ah, uh, I don't even know what numbers that said. Come on. Okay, you need to make some ammo. Can't make ammo for that one, sadly. Oh, well. Hey! Got it. You know, it's wild to me is it only took me getting off of the freaking ledge. <laughs> you the this, safest place. You it's like, no, four go. times, but none of those times were because of the enemy you were fighting. It was all just <laughs> dealing it, with it that was, ledge. It was that ledge. Take a seat. What? You're going to thank her after what she just said? Dr. Sobek has made the situation very clear, General, and given us an option. We should all be thanking her. No, it's just. I mean, my God. What is she Maybe proposing? Maybe take this discussion offline. Huh. There's not going no, that to means... be any discussion. You saw the numbers. Now, Pharaoh, he'll foot the bill, but his money can't buy the time necessary to complete Zero Dawn. That's it. Yeah. That can only be paid for in blood. Oh, So people are going to die. If we upgrade our fleet, crack the code somehow... Were you not listening? Robots can't do the fighting fleet this time. When it comes to hacking, this rogue swarm is an apex predator. Anything automated you throw at it, they will hijack and take over. Ah. But this, we'd be throwing civilians into a meat grinder. Commanders, the enemy we're facing self-replicates faster than we can kill it. Little rabbits. And it eats biomass as fuel. That's us. Zero Dawn is all we've got. What is it? So we put a railgun in the hand of every civilian strong enough to carry one, show them where the trigger is, yep. and point them to the front? How the hell do we sell that? By giving them something to fight for. Zero Dawn. The top secret super weapons program that will save us. So long as humanity holds off the swarm long enough for Dr. Sobek and her team to finish it. 
The file I'm sending contains the war plan for Operation Enduring Give our stunned Future. silence since it's all plan? coming together, but not this at all. No. Crime. It may be ugly, but it's something. Consider the alternative. Dr. Sobek. I've secured use of a decommissioned orbital launch base outside Bryce, Utah as the Zero Dawn staging area. Plenty of space there. When can you get started? I've already mailed you a list of Alpha and Beta candidates. Wow. Most are foreign nationals or subjects of corporate holdings, so extracting them... Leave that to me. You'll get your dream team. Count on it. Then I'll be off. Alright. Still a little confused. Be rid of that place. Now I just need to find the orbital launch base they talked about. I've checked my data and located the base. Oh, this is all that. And the bad? It's directly underneath the citadel. The palace at Sunfall. Okay. The capital of the Shadow Karja. Oh. Not exactly convenient. Mm. The palace is crawling with Eclipse agents. Many you know, it's the only thing that I'm all of them wearing focus. not appreciating as much as I feel like I should be is that I thought early on my fight is with this Shadow Karja, right? And, it, and it's more exploration well, right, than I thought it would be up to this point. Um, you know, you just I shouldn't say that, but you probably just cursed yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're probably about to have to fight a lot of Shadow Karja. I don't mind that. That's what I thought the story would take me there. Uh, Less about who is this. Like, I have no idea why they they attacked us and what they're plotting and trying to do yeah i wonder if that's all going to tie together because it sort of felt like a that's a side story to the main story and yeah. somehow it's all going to tie together could be maybe they have answers y'all this is me just thinking aloud and not saying that i do and or don't like We're doing a lot of thinking aloud. yeah look you got a whatever that thing is you got a fire spitter Oh! oh. <laughs> Whoa, that was good! Thank you! I like that. That was really nuts. Research the thug. They were bandits. I like how I just quickly saved and the bandits showed up and be like, hey, it looks like you're... Can you shoot them with it from across the water? I don't know that I want to. I take them out. There's these uh, horse monster robots. Yep, we're gonna borrow one. Absolutely, I'm gonna touch it. Oh, he's angry! He's angry! Whoa, a thing happened. Th does it intentionally always make you kind of zap their butts when you do that? You know, it's mostly because I attacked them. Oh, that like angle. Something you're doing. Yeah, I'm like creeping up on them. Yeah, creeping up and touching butts. Uh, I, you know, I didn't necessarily touch. I, I got close enough to give it a virus. How does Aaron get everywhere before you? That's what I'm wondering. I wonder that about, like, Uncharted games, Tomb Raider games. Oh, we're going to explore this mysterious place that no one has been in in thousands of years. Oh, bad guy. He's already here. Of hair, well, at least it's not the same specific bad guy. It's usually, like, just some of the henchmen. And you're like, it's always henchmen. But I'll believe that the henchmen were already here. If the henchmen got all the way in here then what am I exploring for the first time? They've already set up their ways to get through. That's true. Like, you've gone through this maze of a passage and you've solved all of these puzzles and you open the door and inside- There's some henchmen. henchmen. And you're like, that means they got in there, took the time to relock it. Maybe they came in a different way. The under their clothes. Well, someone left here recently. Oh, here we go. Hurry. There's a, did you see that ghost? Yeah. You have to follow now the ghost. I'm following the track. I had to highlight the track. Ghost. Ghost. I'm a ghost, 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 ghost. Oh. He's just sleeping. Jack had a, a, a bit too much mead. Must have been. Maybe because he found Ball? something. Look at this. Oh, what? Well, well, he was drawing a map with his blood. Right. He was doing that. He was drawing football plays. That might be Pitchcliff. <laughs> he marked a spot to the oh left. man, you're not gonna know this reference. That it Remember looks like when you select plays in Madden. Grab them and meet you like. there. No, he probably wrote out so dark the con of man that you've never seen Da Vinci Code nor read it, right? I have not. It was an anagram for Madonna on the Rocks, and it's what kicked off the entire movie. We had this conversation. Yep. 
Yep, yep. Um, but I am aware of Madonna. I've heard her music. Even <laughs> Definitely not what I'm talking I've about. Some but... of, I've seen some of her movies. Madonna on the rocks is not about the Madonna you think it is. <laughs> I don't know. She's pretty on the rocks right now. <laughs> oh. You better be able to ride Jeez. this thing. Looks like they've been chained up. Durval's a tinker. He probably <laughs> He's a stinker. <laughs> Maybe I can use them to Durval's a stinker. I'll go Look out first. for him. Hold off until the fighting starts. All right, we've got your back. It's that one. I mean, they can't really hurt you. Kill the Outlanders and machines. Sorry, y'all. I don't think that works. Free. The chains. Don't shoot the chains. Did I just mess that all up? I don't know. I don't know if you have a choice. What I do think what you might have done that could have caused yourself some grief here is uh, you loosed two of them at once, probably one at a time. Oh! Oh, ouch. Oh, this is it's gonna be challenging. What are your friends doing? Are they helping? Uh, three star, three star. Critical hit. Okay. That was easy. That was easy. Get him. Good thing he took a moment to just chill. Uh, he's about to come a mail wave. Oh, he does have guns, does he? Oh, he did not hit me with it. Oh, uh, who got you? What got I don't know. you? Somebody got me. Though. Something from behind you. Right? I don't think. I don't know. Maybe. Okay, buddy. Okay. Oh, okay. shots in the face. This guy's amazing. When they're recruiting people. They're like, look, how many arrows can you take to the base? Because that's going to be key to your survival. Oh. He's going to hide behind that. Mm. Flint yourself time. Well, Ooh. that might be it. Maybe you're supposed to sneak around and take everybody out. That is how it is. We just don't know. What's what? They're being frozen. Bye. Oh. Who is freeze shotting them? Somebody finally doing their job. How are you still alive? It says here. No, get out! No, he dodged you. Fair and square. See, look. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, that one you dodged. Fair. And no fair. ammo. I'm shooting precisions? Oh, yeah. You know what, though? You were taking them out. I mean, you know, except for the ones that didn't get out. And you're hiding behind that, you son of a gun. You. Son of a gun, son of a gun. 15. These people are incredible. Look at all those arrows. Just shaking them off. Like, you're fighting a bunch of Taylor Swifts. And he's nowhere I can hit. No, no, no. Oh, that's no. that silly. That's silly. Again, again, again. Okay. He is brutal. Overpowered, like yeah. so OP. I go to strike, and she's like, "Nah, uh, uh. I'll hit you three times before uh -huh. you hit me once." Say the magic word. Yep. Oh. Yeah. That's like, wow. <laughs> oh no, oh no. They are, she is just insane. Oh, life, life. Do you remember what button? Oh. Uh, no. I had to write then down. See? I, I will come back here. You know what's vindicating is that uh, everybody else gets to see it. I'm 
above. It, at least it's not a. I haven't had trouble in specific areas, and this is. Are they laughing at you though? Are they like, ah, oh, you're terrible at this? Uh, I mean, ultimately, it doesn't matter, you know. Yeah, I guess not. You're but the whatever. One to play. All right. Well, that was day five. Day five. And we were learned... halfway through. Yeah. We, we learned a little more. Actually, I don't think we learned a lot more. No. We did learn that uh, Aloy's potentially clone mother mm -hmm. went to the government, the military, actually, and said, hey, we need to do this. And they were like, you're crazy. This is crazy. And we said, you're right. We're like, you're right. And so they said, okay, well, we're going to give you this uh, orbital launch base that's empty to work on Zero Dawn. And so now we are on our way to find this orbital launch base and find out what Zero Dawn was, what the heck happened. But uh, on our way there, we're getting wrecked. Oh, yeah, getting wrecked. <laughs> Either way. Thank you guys so much for watching. All right, y'all. Take it easy. See ya.